The Japanese automaker Honda introduced a mainstream luxury and performance division named Acura. This division focused on luxury elements but combined technological innovation with world-class performance to stand out among the leading supercar manufacturers worldwide. This is the story of Acura. The story of the launch of Acura is quite fascinating. It was the first ever premium Japanese luxury car brand. It came into existence after the Japanese government imposed export restraints on cars destined for the US. It made more sense for car manufacturers to assemble and export profit-heavy vehicles. Acura had to compete with a small number of renowned and established luxury brands of their time. Their success story shows how they redefined the luxury car industry while inspiring more brands to kickstart their ventures in this category. The Acura division was established back in 1986. The brand was launched with the slogan, Precision Crafted Automobiles. In the first few years of their launch, they were pretty popular in the United States. After that, Acura was among the best-selling brands, bringing some well-established brands like BMW and Mercedes to their knees with their popularity. Their popularity was not long-lived. The emerging brand suffered a decline in sales in the 90s. Acura caught public attention again after a significant revival in the 2000s with the major redesign and introduction of new models. The decline of Acura can also be categorized with the era of the bubble economy. During the prosperous period until 1991, there was a massive influx of cash for local industry and a skyrocketing Japanese market. When the economy went into a downturn, brands like Acura suffered. Hence, the upcoming models were not as impressive as before. The first car to come out from Acura was the Legend Sedan, reborn under the Acura brand in 1986. The Legend Sedan was equipped with a V6 engine, the very first to ever come in a Honda vehicle, along with other features like manual transmission and a four-wheel independent suspension system. Other luxury cars of that time came with auto transmission. Car enthusiasts and end-users found this feature appealing. That was one of the reasons it was so popular in the United States. The Acura Legend sedan was quite popular among the masses. Followed by the success of the Legend sedan, Acura Vigor was launched in 1992. This time, Acura failed to get public attention on a massive scale and the model lived an unfortunate and short-lived three years before discontinuing in 1994. Acura Vigor barely touched 50,000 sales figures in North America and failed to make a name for itself. In the early 2000s, Acura had planned to launch brand new and exclusive models starting with an original SUV, the MDX, and two new models, RSX and TSX, which replaced the previous Integra Coupe and Sedan. These models brought back the hype for the brand and were quite popular among car buyers. As a result, the sales figures had hit an all-time high of 140,000 in 2000 after the launch of new lineups. 170,000 in the coming year and continued to grow and hit an all-time high each year. Acura has also appeared in many famous movies. It's good marketing and advertising strategy for getting exposure to a broader range of audiences. Pulp Fiction featured an Acura NSX. Built in 1991, it featured a V6 engine with 270 horsepower at its heart. It would go from 0 to 60 miles per hour in well under 6 seconds. That was too good for a car of that specs in 1991. It was an exotic sports car starting at a price more affordable than any other sports car. In the movie, Winston Wolf is speeding off to breakfast in his silver 1992 NSX. This caught the eyes of many who weren't quite familiar with Acura's latest sports car. Marvel and Acura began association back in 2010. Marvel featured a ZDX in Iron Man. In 2011, a promotional campaign was announced, making Acura the official brand of Marvel's fictional S.H.I.E.L.D. Soon after, several Acura models were spotted in the films Thor and Captain America. Marvel's Avengers was one of the most anticipated movies of all time. Acura managed to grab the rights to showcase their cars in Marvel movies. However, the vehicle presented in Avengers was a prototype, Acura NSX, released for customers in 2015. It was a 1991 Acura NSX, but a roadster's body. Acura, since its inception, has been actively involved in American motorsports.
Their sports racing program dates back to 1986. Actively participating in American motorsports, Acura sports teams have captured various titles such as the International Sedan Manufacturers Championship and three consecutive International Sedan Drivers Championship, 1988 to 1990. In 2006, the company announced that it would be participating in a very competitive American Le Mans series competing in the LMP2 class during the 2017 season against various other manufacturers. Also, Acura Motorsports teams won the SCCS World Championship in 1997 using the NCC and Integra. Though Acura is a Japanese brand, a division of Honda, most of its cars are made in North America throughout Ohio. The models assembled there include TLX, ILX, RDX, and MDX. The Anna plant produces engines and other components like drivetrain components. Marysville is home to the Acura Performance Center and the NSX Supercar's birthplace. Here are some interesting facts about Acura. Surprisingly, the word Acura doesn't mean anything in Japanese. Instead, it's a slight modification of the Latin word Accu, meaning mechanically precise or done with precision. The NSX was a supercar that you could use every day. Most of the supercars of that era were exotic and weren't practical for everyday usage. Furthermore, most of the supercars were Italian. They had poor reliability and running costs and were exorbitant. After the NCX arrived, it had already impacted how industry experts thought about how sports cars should be. It bore all features like aerodynamics and speeds greater than 300 km per hour while still maintaining usability and didn't require a second mortgage to maintain. When it comes to performance, Acura makes no compromises. Built around the motto, Precision, Acura Engine Technologies provides excellent performance and long durability for long-term uses. Some models even offer precision all-wheel steer for increased agility and stability on winding roads. All Acura models provide support for custom upgrades to the exterior and interior. Owners can upgrade their cars according to their preferences. Available upgrades include leather upholstery, large touchscreen displays, a sunroof, and more. Since the start of the Acura division, a lot has changed in the automotive manufacturing industry. Acura has evolved as a company, delivering quality products with luxurious branding and accessible to many buyer groups. It continues to be a leading catalyst for many changes in the industry. Acura inspired many other brands, like Toyota and Nissan, Lexus and Infiniti to launch their luxury brands. The launch of the 1990 NSX was a practical alternative to exotic European sports cars while introducing some new cutting-edge technology like Honda's VTEC variable valve system. All the luxury Japanese brands we see on our roads today result from the bold step Honda took all those years back. Many features, such as super handling all-wheel drive, advanced compatibility engineering, and variable valve timing are entirely owed to Acura. And with that, our video comes to an end. I hope you enjoyed the story of Acura, and if you have any thoughts, let us know in the comments below. See you next time!